Ruchika Kirhotra and Aradhana Gupta were students, neighbors, friends, leading ordinary lives which were soon to be shattered. Ruchika was molested by Haryana's senior most police officer, SPS Rathor. Aradhana saw it all, becoming an unwitting witness. Ruchika filed a case against her molester, but Rathor hit back with harassment and victimization. Three years later, traumatized, humiliated, Ruchika killed herself. Aradhana promised to fight for her friend, and she never gave up. She fought for 19 years in courts, in government offices, to punish the molester Rathor. At last, a long and hard battle won. Rathor was found guilty by the courts. With the case reopened, Aradhana is now fighting for a harder sentence for the molester of her best friend. NDTV salutes Aradhana's determination, courage and loyalty. The road to justice, of course, has been long. It's been very, very tedious. Now, what many people would perhaps want to know is how do you find the strength to go on not one year, not five years, not, not even a decade, close to two. Nineteen years is how long you've been fighting. What kept you going day after day? Um, my grandfather, he was a freedom fighter. So he selflessly fought for this country. And uh, my family atmosphere where I've been raised by my parents, um, they have taught me to raise our voice against injustice and uh, I think the wordings of Ruchika um, also that uh, these people should be exposed and we should not let it go basically everybody should fight against injustice so I think that that is um, these are the things that kept me going all these years truly incredible and inspiring Ishwarya from one woman of substance to another well I just like to say God bless you Aradhana and may there be many 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 more Aradhanas in this world it's important <laughs> <laughs>